There is for two of them, take it from them, then it falls. If you're some, I don't think it's some. It is better than that. If you're a son, I think. Let them see the goodness of the Lord. Let them see the goodness of the Lord. To be taken by the choir.
according to my will. Selecting us to be witnesses to this big reward. 
at the end, each other will go to heaven. To be very happy and proud, if we ask most of the women here today whether their husbands are helping them to go to heaven, <laughs> Mafia, is Dr. Mafia helping you to go to heaven? I don't know. How about here? I don't know. This one, this one, for what? Ah, but the dead, sitting man, no one, no one, no one, no What man, no one, 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 And you know, two of them are complimentary. Each other, you oppose each other. You make your wife very, very, Unhappy, you make your husband very, very unhappy, and the opportunity of missing heaven is also there. If at all it happens that you, you are so naughty with a wife, so troublesome a wife, and your husband, because of that, turns your love and gets to another woman, and you turn your attention to another man. Would you stay in the state of infidelity and sinful relationship in order to go to heaven? Rather, heaven, who is loving each other? Man, quite a lot of it, and love you to go to heaven. So the duty of the good wife, the duty of the good husband, is to help each other to go to heaven. That is a dimension that has not been very much. It leaves the whole issue of marriage from the issue of many coming together to satisfy sexual things and desire. No, it goes beyond that into generating the family and over and above that helping each other to go to heaven to be fulfilled and happy. I was reading the testimony of Pope Benedict the 16th, buried yesterday. Every pope is expected to write a testimony and to leave it behind. After its funeral, the testimony will be read. It has been posted on our uh, platform and I went through it. I saw that the compliment that Pope Emeritus left, the great man, the compliment to that testimony that the Pope has given to his father and his mother. He says that he got the faith, the faith he manifested even as a child, through childhood, up to papacy, going through all the confusions of the generation up to 95 years. The faith from the father and the mother from home guided him all through. Most of us who have become free can say that. See now now what we need and some of them for our sins. Then I can't get both the letter. One my father had it. But he didn't say that you could have a son who take you through. So my advice is, Victor, Mary, uh, sister, as you are beginning a family now, have you gotten enough religious or spirituality, religious faith, that will make you to transmit that faith from you, yourself, to your home, to your children, in such a way that this faith will help your children to go to bed. Special in life, they look on to the faith from the father and the mother, and then overcome and do what they have chosen to do in life till the end. And that brings another point in this marriage to the poor, the poor are. What does that mean? If you stay together as husband and wife, you show your faith to one another in God. The children that will come from this bond of life will be responsible children, responsible citizens of our nation. 
became a pilot and they were flying in this uh, Ibom air to Lagos or Abuja and the mother, this woman was given a special treatment, special food, no any special media. That's what they are not getting on what they are not getting on what they are not getting on. But why is your food better than my own? Are you not getting on what they are not my son is the pilot. My son is the pilot. I could be the pilot. Now, what I'm doing now, I'm saying, I'm going to turn the air to where the sun is shining. I'm going to fly in the sky. So I'm going to get a new cup of water. I'm going to get a new cup of water. I'm going to get a new cup of water. I'm going to get a new cup of water. So, if you withstand all the storm all the temptation. Away from one another, work very hard to train. God uses, God uses our children to raise many of us. And by the way, if you are failure in an hour, even in uh, Nambra or even state, in the area of children, if you generate rasta, you are failure as a person. Yes, you know, we do not have to do that. It will be for. Therefore, it pays to stay together in the man to create an atmosphere of love, children, to create an atmosphere of peace, so that the children will grow and turn up to become responsible citizens, hardworking citizens, successful and reliable citizens. These are the people that we take responsibility in the country, in the nation, also in the church. From here do we get candidates for the priesthood, from the family. Therefore, don't joke with your family, no matter how young you may be. You are young people beginning it and Mary Sinta, but in this journey, God is going to use two of you to bring responsible citizens into our country into our family, into our church. We ask you to realize very heavily as you have chosen the, the reading concerning prayers. Pray very well. Take aim at taking each other to help. Also into heaven. And you see how happy your marriage uh, would be. If you push God aside, forget about it. It will not work. I have talked a lot about the man, Victor, with regard to the first reading, I go to the second reading. And my attention will be on the woman now. Women, submit to your offer. The word, the word, submission, the word submission,
he spoiled the relationship through sinful behavior. But thanks be to God, the second woman, Mary, the mother of God, redeemed him. And through her years and submissiveness to God, we have been able to get redemption in Jesus Christ. So if you are like the blessed Virgin Mary, so I can be this and Mary me. Her face looks like that of Blessed Virgin Mary on the wedding day. I hope this will continue in the house so that you'll be able to make a happy home, a good and nice family. Before I preach so long to be brief, I have an example to give. A student was told to me when I went on a portfolio walk in Dr. Jonathan of how naughty and difficult a wife was in the marital world. The husband died after so many years. The wife who died when he went to the other world to the gate of heaven. She asked Peter to tell her where the husband was in the other world. The husband she didn't like very much. <laughs> Over the other world she was looking for the husband. Where is my husband? Okay, Peter said, let me see where I can indicate or locate your husband and send you to the place. Open the book of the saints to say all the saints. They didn't see the husband there. Okay. Where is my husband, please? He died. Mentioned the years, about 20 something years ago. Was a widow living alone. Where can I find him? Okay, there's another book, second book, the book of those who are in hell, hell, hell. They check. The husband was not there. The woman started crying. Look at where she went to look for the husband after messing the husband up. Where is my husband? They say, okay, wait. There is another register kept for those in poor country. They brought me the register. They look and look and look and look and look. I have not mentioned the name of your husband, mention it, not far. The woman broke down, wept, but weeping. Not in hell, not in heaven, not in poor country. Okay, Peter told the woman, there is another book and one book remaining. Now, let me bring that book. Mention the name of your husband. The woman mentioned the name of the husband and the open. Okay, 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 okay. The name is here. Which book was that? The book of the martyrs. Martyrs. You know, those who are martyrs, those men who are people who can body them. I want to be man, someone who is safety. I can body them. We give nothing what of life of the wife when I'm there by the martyrs.
know how to relate to their mother in law, you know how to relate to their mother in law, father in law, mother in law. He turns for the newly wanted couple to be happy. He turns for them to be happy. One woman I was doing the marriage course here told me, Father, can you preach in the church one and tell them our mother in law when we want to be happy, because the thing for not to be happy in marriage. But when we want to show that we are happy in marriage, the mother in law will be very sad to come and spoil our happiness. Father, talk to the mother. Mother, please don't come back with the joy and happiness of your daughter in law. And they are taught to let allow them to be happy, promote them, and let it be mutual relationship. You respect each other and love each other according to where God wants us to, to, to do. So we will pray for our daughter here, we pray for our son, we ask God to help her to be spiritual people in marriage. The word, faithful woman, submissive woman, when they did it like this, what God has said to come to what God has done in her, let them know that to us. May God bless them and give them happiness in their marital life. Let our prayer go right now. My dear friends, very sincere and grateful, we have come together in this church so that the Lord may see and strengthen the love in the presence of the priest and this congregation. Christ, the one that we bless this matter and love, He has already consecrated you in baptism. And now he enriches and strengthens you by a special sacrament, so that we may assume the duties of marriage in a mutual and lasting fidelity. And so, in the presence of the church, I ask you to state your intentions. Very sincere and vital. I have come here freely and without any reservation to give yourself to each other in marriage. Yes, yes I have. Yes, I have. Will you love and honor each other as husband and wife for the rest of your life? Yes, I have. Yes, yes, I will. Will you accept children loving you from God and bring them up according to the laws of Christ and His church? Yes, I will. 
Yes, I. Since it is your intention to intend to marry, join your right hands and declare your consent before God and the people. Hi, Victor Malaki Robert. Do take Mary Cynthia Mwako to be my love, loveful wedded wife, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, and for poorer, the sickness in her, to love and to cherish to the day of I promise you, I promise you to be faithful. I promise you my faithfulness. I am Mary Cynthia Wanko. Do take Victor Malakiko. To be my love to wear that number. To have and to hold from this day. From this day forward, for better and for worse, for richer and for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, to death do us bad. I promise you my faith in you. Victor Emanto Malaki Obot. Obot. You have declared your consent before the church. May the Lord in his goodness strengthen your consent and fill you both with his blessing. You have declared your consent before the church. May the Lord in his goodness strengthen and confirm the consent you have given and enrich you with his blessings. By the authority of the church, I ratify and bless the bond of marriage you have consented to and contracted in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. What God has joined together, let no man put asunder. God our Father, bless these things which we bless in your name. Grant that Mary Cynthia and Victor, who wear them, may always have the faith in each other. May we be our own only and live together in peace with the Lord. We ask this for Christ. Thank you. 
Their love for each other may endure for as long as they both shall live. We pray to the Lord. For fruitfulness in their marriage. That God who commanded Adam and Eve to be fruitful and multiply may bless Victor and Mary Cynthia with the gift of respect responsible and God-fearing children. We pray to the Lord. Thank you. 
the intercession of our Blessed Mother Mary, as we say, Hail Mary. Make our prayers through Christ our Lord. For your care we take care. It all may be in our own. And I'll be there can't keep. For your own and your own. Offering time. The offertory will be once. Please make it fine. Then choir. It is the Lord's birthday, oh, it is the 
Oh, 
Receive, we pray, O Lord, the offering made on the occasion of this healing of the sacred form of marriage. And just as your goodness is its origin, may your providence guide it us. We make our prayers through Christ our Lord. The Lord be with you. Lift up your hearts. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is really right and just our duty and our salvation always and everywhere to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God. For you have forged the covenant of marriage as a sweet yoke of harmony and an unbreakable bond of peace, so that the chaste and fruitful love of holy matrimony may save to increase the children you adopt as your own. By your providence and grace, O Lord, you accomplish the wonder of this twofold design that while the birth of children brings beauty to the world, their rebirth in baptism gives increase to the church through Christ our Lord. Through him, with the angels and all the saints, we sing the hymn of your praise as without end we acclaim.
You are indeed holy, O Lord, the font of all holiness. May to the rest of this gift we pray, by sending down your strength for them that they do fall, so that they come for us, the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly with his passion, he took bread and giving thanks, broke it and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the and once more giving time, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will work out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins to this in memory of me. Giving thanks that the God was worthy to win your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, you be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church, spread throughout the world, and bring her to the fullness of charity. Together with Francis Apu and coming with Norman, Bishop and all the things. Be mindful also, Lord, of Victor and Mary Cynthia, whom you have brought to their wedding day, so that by your grace they may abide in good and love. Amen. Remember also our brothers and sisters, who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your faith. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with the Blessed Apostles, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co heads to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Peritum et comito et inito, et video patri omnipotenti, in unitate spiritu sancti, omnis honor et gloria, per omnia sempre se
Dear brothers and sisters, let us all be great and know that at least is Sarah now married in Christ. The message will pour out blessings of his grace. Make of one heart and know by the sacrament of Christ for the Lord, those he has joined are for the covenant. O God, who by your almighty power created all things out of nothing, and when you had set in place the beginnings of the universe, formed man and woman in your own image, making the woman an inseparable element to the man that there might no longer be two that one way, and thus that what would at least make one must never be divided. For God who consecrated the bond of man by so great a mystery, that in the wedding covenant you foreshadowed the sacrament of Christ and his church. For God by no woman is joined to man, and the companionship they had in the beginning is endowed with the one blessing not forbidden by original sin, nor washed away by the glory. Look now with devil on this your servant, joined together in marriage, who ask to be strengthened by your blessing. Send out on them the grace of the Holy Spirit, and pour your love into their hearts that they may remain faithful in the marriage of the Lord. May the grace of love and peace abide in your daughter Mary Sinti, and let her always follow the example of those holy women whose praises are sung in the scriptures. My husband entrusts his heart to her, so that acknowledging her as his equal, and his joint head the life of grace, he may show her due honor and cherish her always with the love that Christ has for the truth. And now, Lord, we implore you, may this your servant hold fast in the prayer and keep your covenant made one in the flesh. May they be blameless in all they do and with the strength that comes from the gospel. May they bear true witness to Christ before all. May they be blessed with children and prove themselves virtuous parents who live to see their children's children. And grant us reaching at last to grab the fullness of the earth for which they hope they may come to the life of the blessed in the kingdom of heaven. Peace of the Lord be with you always. Let us offer each other the sign of peace.
Behold the Lamb of God. Behold the most excellent in the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say your word, and my soul shall be. May the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ be us tonight everlasting. Amen. Amen. I mean, here you were with you. Maybe I got to the heaven as for it. There go work and let me add that to me. And you get to work and say, say. You get to the Lord and let me be there. Good. Yes. It is a lot. You go. Okay. So I'm all about it. Okay. I can be the same way to the communion. Yeah. And for the I come in Sene, I was in Meso, I put from me young for me. Meso, I take the forum by a day, but in the forum for the ten, no one ten in Amki young for me. I was in the storm in Bong in the Arab of me, Amen. I come up for me. Oh, Jesus, I was in the Yadip, go out, men walk me so poor, young for no fee, Amen. I come in my youth, and in my children, Mamma. My brother prays with me the book. I tell the man Jesus, he do cook for me. I me a book with them for dear. I me eat from one. I me them for fruit tree. A book with them, he eat cook for me. Who do robbers? I'm very very sensitive. Amen. But if you move a mass, I mean, I no care who care who. He bought Jesus Christ. I am the God that lives in my life and I am the God that lives in my life.
Dong Atau Bon Dong Ini mau ngomong apa pun Ini kan Ini kan Ini kan Ini kan Ini kan Tapi ini kan 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 The parents of the bride will come up for, to be the witnesses in signing of marriage. Yeah. Parents of the bride and parents of the groom.
the presentation of the marriage certificate. Patrick Dawson of Ikori Pene, Bible Ted, Nigeria. Marriage certificate. This is to certify that Mr. Victor Malaki, both of Ikoroba in Sinan Parish for and Miss Mary Senta Wankwa of Ipiti Duno in St. Mary of a parish upon fulfillment of the requirements of the provisions of canons. 1055 to 1165 of the 1983 Code of Canon Law, Catholic Church, and on the authority of the Diocese and Bishop, Most Reverend Camillus Raymond Mumar, have been joined in the sacrament of holy matrimony in the presence of the Reverend Father Matthew Marput, who received their consent on behalf of the church and Dr. Ifya D. Opia and Mrs. Inemesi I, I Opia as witnesses at St. Anne's Cathedral here in Ivor this sixth day of January 2023. This certificate is presented to the newly wedded couple by me, the parish priest, Father Christopher more.
Almighty and eternal God, look down upon Victor and Maria, Mary Cynthia, who ask for your blessing as they begin their matrimonial home together. We, the people of God, have presented them with the first gift. We pray that you may bless them, sustain their love for one another, and may they continue to abide in your love and in peace. In Amafure Benemi, Uto Christ, Oba. Amen. Yen Yagaba Sendi Kunkan, it says, Ye Yen Yedisana Spirit, Odia Mayunga Kwemembuko, Kemi, Ye Ken Sen Sen Sen. Amen. We continue to stand for the final blessing. Yeah, can see that. Uh. The Lord be with you. Bow your heads and pray for God's blessing. May God eternal Father keep you of one heart in love for one another. The peace of Christ may dwell in you and abide always in your home. Amen. Amen. May you be blessed in your children, have solace in your friends, and enjoy true peace with everyone. Amen. Amen. May you be witnesses in the world to God's charity, so that the afflicted and needy who have known your kindness may one day receive you thankfully into the eternal dwelling of God. Amen. Amen. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. The Mass is ended. Go in the peace of Christ. Father, yes, you take the altar with the new link, wedded couple.